Okay, I want to share with you Simon Tovkov Nun Zayin. We know that uh, one of my favorite trivia questions are what brachas do you only say once a year? What brachas do you only say once a year? So you have the Hadlik Ner Shel Yom HaKippurim. You have Al Biur Chametz. What else do you have? Leishe Basuka? <laughs> right? You have. Um, and Nachim. Nachim on Tishabav. No, you have Lahad Likner and Shasi you say every night. And Shachianu you could say many times throughout the year. Right? So Lahad Likner Shem Wikiburim. Al Bir Chametz. You have any others? If you live in Eretz Yisrael, al achilas matzah. Okay. Simon Tov Kof Nazan. B'tishu b'av oimer hashatz anenu b'bracha b'fnei atzmai b'en goyal aroife b'shachras. Tishu b'av, in the morning, the Sheyach Tzibur says goyal, says anenu, between, as a separate bracha, between goyal and roife, shachras. Why doesn't anybody else say it shachras? Because nobody knows for sure they'll be able to make it through the fast. Once mincha time, you know, it's pretty safe you'll make it through. Shachar is not safe. And how could the shot say it? Because Mestama, someone in the Kehillah will, will make it through the fast. Umincha, the shot says it as, as a separate bracha by mincha. V'yachid oimra v'mincha b'shemei atfila. A yachid says it mincha by shemei atfila. V'yem shakcha, if you forgot, anina in machzir noisai. You don't go back. K'may b'chol tayna sivar. V'oimrim b'mincha b'bayne Yishayim nachem Hashem alekeinu esavei letziyayim. Mincha, on Tisha B'av, you say the bracha of Nachem. V'im shachach, this is interesting, if you forgot Nachem, Oimra ba'avoida, you could say it in Ritzay. You could say it in Ritzay. V'loi b'shaymei ha'atfila, k'aydem v'sechazena. Now if you forgot Nachem, what, how does Nachem end? Menachem tziyayin v'yirushalayim. What, um, can I have a, how does Nachim end? Menachim Tzion Uboine Yerushalayim, I believe. No, Menachim Tzion Uboine Yerushalayim. Menachim Tzion Uboine Yerushalayim. But if you forgot Nachim and you're saying it in Ritzei, you do not end Menachim Tzion, you end V'sachazena Eneinu B'Shulchot Tzion Barachamim. Ad Seifer Bracha. V'im Hizkir B'Shamei Atfila, what if you forgot it? But what if you remembered it in Shema Kelenu? In Sarach Lahazkir Oid Ba'avoida. You wouldn't have to say it again in, in uh, Ritzei. V'im Loi Omar, if you forgot Nachim totally, in Machzir Naisei. Here's a million dollar question. What if you have to eat on Tisha B'av? Do you say Nachem in Berchas HaMazayin? And another thing is, do you say Nachem in the morning? You don't say Nachem in the morning, it's not time. So what if you're a Choyle and you're eating in the morning? If you say it, do you even say it by breakfast? Says the Shana Lachas, Yesh Oimrim. Well, I want to read to you the Mechaber. This is Simon Tavkov Nun Zayin. The Mechaber says, the Ramah says, Mi Sha'achal Betishabav Yoimar Nachim Beberchas Amazoin. You say Nachim, the Ramah says. He quotes the Maril. And even though the, Ramah, the Mishnah says, in Davening we don't say it, Shachar is only by Mincha. That's a minog. But by Berchus HaMazayin, there's no minog. So you say it by every meal. But some Achreinim question this, whether you should say nach, Nachim. Weir invention would you add it? Where would you add it? Mm, yeah. Yeah. You would add it before Uvenei. 
you would add it over from there. The Shari Tshuva brings Achroinim that question this, and the Be'er Hagra is mashma not to say it. Everyone would agree if you didn't say it, you don't have to go back, but it sounds like the Mishnah Bruce's conclusion is you should say it. Um, the Kafachayim says Sheva Al Tasa not to say it because maybe it would be a hefsek. The Kloisenberger Rebbe and Tshuva writes, you Davka should say it. Why? Because we know anyone who eats and drinks on Tisha B'Av will not see the Simchas Yushalayim. So what if somebody has to drink because of an oynes? He should dafka go out of his way to say Nachim to show that despite the fact that he has to eat, he's Mesabal Yushalayim. Bottom line is, Halach Lamaisa, someone who's eating on Tisha B'Av should say Nachim. Um, let's see how Rab Chaim says it. Yeshem Shemishach B'Tazer Yomer Nachim Berchus Amazayin. Biyesh Mefachvin Shalai Omer B'Chem Asher B'Bir Hagra. So that's a very interesting halacha that if somebody is going to be eating on Tisha B'Av, they should say Nachim in Berchus Amazayin. That's why coming back to the trivia question, Nachim is maybe not a good answer because you don't only say it once a year because someone who's fasting. Someone who's eating, he could be eating three times a day. He'll be, he, he'll be saying Nachim four times. Anyway, so that's, uh, that's what we got today, okay? So, everybody say, have a great day. Call to everyone.